If you want the very best storage performance, buy an SSD large enough for your operating system and favorite software. Then add a hard drive for all of your important user data. We recommend at least 120 gigabytes of solid state space to give you room for Windows, productivity apps, and games. Although many enthusiasts are comfortable with less capacity by 64 or even 32 gig SSDs and manage their data manually, caching is an affordable alternative that improves read performance transparently. The technology requires either a dedicated storage controller with caching support or a Z68 Express-based motherboard, along with an SSD and hard drive, of course. The problem with using an SSD based on MLC flash for caching is that the smaller models tend to sacrifice a lot of write performance. Because cache data is synchronized between the solid state drive and hard disk, a slow SSD can really spoil the experience. An SLC-based model like Intel's SSD311 uses much faster memory to break through those throughput limitations, offering sequential write performance as high as 105 megabytes per second. Capacity is the trade-off. An SSD311 only holds 20 gigabytes, but because software algorithms in the software try to be smart about the data that lives on the SSD, you don't really need a lot of flash-based storage to accommodate cached information. In fact, Intel's smart response technology limits the cache to 64 gigabytes. If your SSD is any larger than that, we say that you should be using it as a boot drive, realizing the full benefit of solid-state tech. It had seemed that Intel agrees.